all and welcome to another episode of Upshift. Today we have with us is the Indian Scout. Indian as a brand name goes way back into the 1900s when in 1928 they came out with their flagship the Scout 101 which was a legendary and apparently the best motorcycle made by Indian. This Indian Scout takes inspiration from the 101 Scout. Now due to a lot of reasons the company went bankrupt in 1952. But thankfully, in 2011, Polaris took over Indian and saved their soul by introducing the Thunderstroke engine. Now, the Scout being a very beautiful machine as in what it is, we are not here for this today. We are here for this. Indian Scout Bobber. Now, Bobber as definition, this is a true Bobber. It's got the tracker handlebar, purposeful foot pegs and a lower rear suspension. It makes it look lethal. The Scout comes with a V-twin engine putting out 95 horsepower and 97 newton meters of torque which is very accessible no matter where you're riding. The Indian Scout Bobber is a joy to ride, easy to maneuver, easy to thrash and with every flick you get that surge of power that you're looking for. The Scout has best in class ground clearance which is very very effective in our city riding especially in India where potholes are everywhere. Let's get to the upshifts of this machine. I will hands down say that this is my most favorite cruiser on sale today. There is nothing like it. There is no more menacing machine better looking than this. The downshifts happen to be it, it is not the perfect bike for long rides as the saddle is a little too low and the handlebars not too upright. So if you're looking for a Hyper Turo or something of that sort, you might look somewhere else. In conclusion, I would like to say, if you're looking for a stress buster bike, something to get on when you come back from a hard day at office and don't want to care about anything else in the world, this is the bike for you.